okay, why does everybody open their mouth wide now? Well, there are a few reasons for that. One is because they're told to. Most voice teachers that we know tell people to open. And they'll even start with children. Children naturally won't open the mouth that wide. They're natural. They want to just say their little words. And they don't make loud sounds unless they imitate adults. But since people think that you somehow need to open your throat, and by doing this, you know, you, <laughs> to do this, you have to open your mouth more, they make you, they actually tell you to open wider. Drop your jaw, open, make more space for the voice. They don't understand. This is absolutely not correct. If you don't have to do it in speaking, you don't have to do it in singing. The word has the same dimension in singing as it does in speech. A person should look like they're talking when they are singing because they are talking when they're singing. That's right. Okay, so why do people do it today? Well, that's one reason. Teachers tell them what to do. Another reason is they're struggling. They're trying to get their voices out. And they somehow have been <laughs> misinformed, misguided into thinking that by opening the mouth wider, raising the palate more, lowering the larynx more, and all of these tricks that they're taught, that they'll make a bigger, more voluminous, more resonant sound. And they all do it. And then what happens is they're fighting with themselves to say their words. Then their words become difficult to say, sometimes even unintelligible completely. And not only that, another reason for not opening the mouth wide is because you'll get behind the beat. Uh, many conductors talk about this. If you keep opening your mouth really wide while you're trying to speak a word, you're going to slow down. The conductors keep saying to singers, stay, uh, you know, stay a tempo, you're, you're behind. They can't do it because they're chewing so much on each syllable that they lose time. It's unhealthy. It has nothing whatsoever to do about good singing. That's my answer. Singing comes from a very deep meditative font yeah. inside of ourselves. And you don't see ever anybody who's meditating <laughs> doing the meditations no, with the you don't need barking to. open mouth like a dog. No. Yeah. It's legato, after all, that distinguishes speech from singing is only simply legato. Yeah.